Hey gang, Comic Book Fever is having a contest. He wants us to show a huge book. That's huge. And of course I'm not going to show this rinky-dink Dave Cooper covered anthology. I'm going to show something that's twice as big and twice as pretentious. It's the oversized Acme Novelty Library number four. At this point it's technically a humor book. And of course the delicious irony with these oversized pages is that you got to get out the magnifying glass to look at these teeny tiny little panels. It's basically the history of cartooning. It's got uh, George Harriman influence and Fleischer Brothers influence. It even has a, a one-page zinger against like 80s retreads of old-time comic strip characters. Because all these independent creators, they love Nancy. The, Mark Newgarden and someone else did a, a deconstruction of Nancy. So Nancy became the Bible. And by the 80s and 90s, Nancy had been restarted, done by Guy Gilchrist, who had done the Muppets. And these independent cartoonists hated it. And usually when an independent comic is oversized, it's because of incompetence, either by the creator or the publisher or the printer. But by this time, cartoonists were like, oh, I gotta break free from the standard comic book form. And the reaction of retailers was, F you. We're not gonna stock this. And the few who did, like my dealer, you know, they had to get crunched like this. They always get crunched right in the middle because they're oversized. I actually bought these from him for a dollar because he couldn't sell them. They were just sitting in the basement, and he was like, would you like to take this for a dollar? I was like, yep. It looks great. It's funny. It's a great, huge book. So thank you to Comic Book Fever. Thank you for this contest. I'll have your link in the description and at the end of the video. And it's funny because, like, critics and interviewers, they'll always compare Chris Ware to Flo Bear and uh, Joseph Cornell. They never compare them to, like, C.C. Beck or George Harriman because they don't know who those people are. Quite frankly, why would they?